In this video, I will show you how to solve Roblox not opening problem in PC. This should be a quick and easy tutorial to follow, but before we do continue, please consider leaving a like on the video and also subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. Now, if for any reason your Roblox is not opening, there's a few things and fixes I'm gonna go through with you today to try and help you with this and get your Roblox player working again. Now, the first thing you're gonna to want to do from your desktop is locate the Roblox player so you can see that's here right click onto the roblox player and on this menu that comes up click onto open file location then on the window that comes up locate the roblox player beta click to highlight it and then right click to bring up this menu now what you want to do is come and click onto properties what that's going to do is open up a small window like this and if you come up to the top you want to click onto compatibility there's a couple of things you're going to want to change in here the first is compatibility mode so you want to tick this to run this program in compatibility mode and make sure this is selected to windows 8. then come down to the settings section and tick the box to run this program as an administrator and also the box which says disable full screen optimizations once that's done, click apply and okay. And then what you wanna do is right click again onto the Roblox player beta. And on this menu that comes up, click to run as administrator. Now, if that didn't work for you, then the next thing you're gonna to want to try is if you come back to your desktop and what you wanna do is come down to your taskbar at the bottom, click onto Windows start icon and open up your settings. If you don't see your settings in your pinned apps, come up to the search box at the top, type settings and open up settings underneath best match. Once your settings window has opened up, what you want to do is come across to the menu on the left hand side and click onto apps. Then what you want to do is click onto installed apps at the top. And what you can do is use the search box at the top and search for Roblox. Now, what you want to do at this point is uninstall all instances of Roblox. So if you've got the studio and the player and things like that installed, you just want to come over and click the three dots for each one and click onto uninstall. Once you've done that, go ahead and close this down. And then what you want to do is come back down to the taskbar and in the search box, you want to go ahead and type run and then open up run underneath best match. Now, in the run box that comes up in the bottom left hand corner you want to type the following which is a percent symbol followed by local app data or one word and then another percent symbol and once you've done that click ok and what that's going to do is open up a window like this in this window what you're going to want to do is search for the roblox folder so this is in alphabetical order so if you just come down to r you should see a folder called roblox once you've located the folder click to highlight right click onto it to bring up this menu and what you want to do is just go ahead and delete this roblox folder now this doesn't delete any saved data or anything this is just storing of your cache and temporary internet files so it's absolutely fine to delete this folder after doing this close this window down and what you want to do is open up a new internet browser come across to robots.com and log into your account now once you're logged in just go ahead and click on any experience you want so in this example we're going to go ahead and click on to please donate then click onto the play button to re-download and reinstall the roblox player now by doing a full clean and installation and reinstall installed in this way it should now hopefully load it should open successfully and you should now be able to play roblox if that didn't work for you instead of using the player you can try using the microsoft windows version of roblox so to do that come down to your search box again in the bottom from your desktop and this time you want to go ahead and type store and then open up the microsoft store underneath best match now in your store what you want to do is use the search box at the top and type roblox and then we're just going to search for roblox and what you want to do is download the top result which is going to be roblox for windows so it's going to say get or install give that a click and then you just need to give it a minute or two to download and install and once that's done see if that load successfully and of course you can use that for now the roblox windows version so if after trying all these methods you're still having problems what i would recommend is disabling any third-party applications so like speed applications and things like that if you've got something like msi afterburner or something like river tuner then make sure to fully disable the speed enhancements and that should allow you to play roblox again successfully let me know in the comments if any of these methods did help you out today and if this video did help you out then i would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel with that being said i just want to take a minute thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and i will see you in the next video